If your cast were to rob a bank, who would be the mastermind and who would be the getaway driver? Great question. <laughs> That's Ooh. such a good question. Best question. So, wait, is that wait, just for me? Yeah. Uh, it's for everyone, right? Everyone, everyone answers. Yeah. Who would be I, the mastermind and the getaway? Who would be the mastermind? Who would be the getaway? Alexa would be the mastermind. Alexa would be the mastermind. No, I actually agree with that. Yeah. I think I'd be the getaway. I think you would, would be, be the getaway. Say, driver. You'd be the getaway driver. She's the mastermind. <laughs> Are we just like? We're just there. Which is which is funny. Which is funny because the story isn't about either of us, and yet this this story is. Yeah. We got we got we got. We got our story somehow. It's hard to talk about because I did it's so much of the movie uh, is incredibly personal. Uh, there's a lot of like autobiography that like spins off in a narrative then comes back again. These guys and the collaboration is what to me makes it the next level, you know, because it started with this very small personal thing to me that then like grew and expanded out and what I kind of believe why if it's touching people or why it feels special because uh, it is it's so personal to me and the most personal people in my life but then like it's like we became a creative family to to fill that out and make it uh, hopefully bigger and, and something else yeah and then you uh, wrote it sort of with Kelvin in mind right he was the first person on board because you guys had worked together before so when he comes to you Kelvin what are your conversations like I mean you just say yes immediately because I know you were looking for something to work on together but you're playing a lot of who he is too that's a lot of pressure yeah, I mean, I, at first I was like, I don't believe you're going to write a part for me. <laughs> like, why would you do that? But then he did it, and I was like, wow, it's good. <laughs> it's really good. But I think the beauty of it is that Trey, um, Trey is so, so smart and so sweet and has so much love. And he, he, took a, 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 he took the opportunity to get to know me and to ask me a lot of questions and really understand what's it like, you know, being young and black and, and what does that mean? And, how do we how do we give this boy his humanity and, and all the things that make him who he is instead of just like putting him in this box that he doesn't belong in? Calvin and I we spent a lot of time together in the beginning before we even went to Florida, um, just kind of getting to know each other. And he would make me do a lot of really <laughs> crazy exercises, like fifty questions, and like film ourselves answering them and. Um, we also watched a lot of YouTube videos on codependent relationships. <laughs> I think it just felt very comfortable to go there with Kelvin. Um, and it, as scary as some of the scenes were, it also I felt safe to go there. So I'm glad that I was given the opportunity by Trey and by Kelvin to really like let out my full chaotic vulnerability. It seems a lot more emotional when you watch it versus like I think how you experience something when you're just going through the motions of doing it mm -hmm. and then when you look back on the experience it feels much more impactful and you maybe don't even realize in the moment because you kind of black out or at least I feel like I black out when I act sometimes mm -hmm. that after when I see it I think oh my gosh that that happened I didn't I didn't know that. <laughs> Not everyone can get Frank Ocean in their movie, get his music in their movie. How did you do that? Uh, just very lucky, very good energy. Uh, I, I just uh, I wrote a letter and we sent the movie to him and his team. And you know, uh, it took some time. His team was like, I don't know, it's not looking good. Maybe you should just do one song. And then all of a sudden, all songs were approved. I don't, you know, I don't know. I don't know if you watched the movie. I don't know what happened. Um, but just feel very, very, very grateful.